Hello there, I am Giant Cool with my Pokemon Ruby Redo. In the last part, we took on. We, uh, met Wally for the first time. We helped him catch a Pokemon, you know. Well, he, uh, got to use one of our dad's, uh, Zigzagoons, and he gave him a Pokeball. He caught a Ralts, which is pretty cool. And, uh, we went out, we went on to Route 104. We battled a couple trainers. Now we're in the Puddlebug Woods. Or we started the Puddlebug Woods, got about maybe halfway. And now here we are still in the Puddlebug Woods. Dang it. I was a Cascoon level 5, by the way. <laughs> if anyone's wondering what that wild encounter was. Okay, if you take Bug Pokemon to school, you get you get to be instantly popular. I don't know if that's true in all cases, but I'll take your word for it for now. Until I can find a better source or proof that that's actually true. Yeah, he's an Ninkata level 8. Cool. So, Ninkata's a bug in ground, so if you start with a Mudkip, uh... If you have, if you, I think Mudkip brings Water Gun in this game at level 10. This, this battle is a lot easier, but since I don't have a grass, since I don't have a water type Pokemon or water type move, yeah, it's gonna take a little longer, as you can see right here. It's just, it's a quick attack and scratch war, basically. I'm using, you know, Gekko's using quick attack, and then the Encounter's using scratch. It's pretty, pretty intense. Not really. Oh, it's good as hard and it switched it up. It switched it up. Nice. Good for you. There we go. Nice. Now we defeat Buckcatcher James. I can't be a puppy if I lose. Oh, sorry, man. Like, for $180 Poké Dollars, though. There's an item coming up, but I don't remember what, what it was. I think it's like an X item. Nope, it's an Ether. My bad. Whatever. <laughs> okay, there we go. Nice. We gotta get away. Get out of this public woods. So this is still Route 104, actually. Cool. This guy will give you the TM for a Bolt Seed. So, yeah, see, like, you can spit stuff, seeds that way fast, and it's like a move, too, apparently. I might want to teach that to, uh. I'm probably gonna, yeah, I'm gonna teach that to Geico, just as a temporary move. It won't be one of its final moves. But just to have another Grass type move other than Absorb. Okay, yeah. Ooh, four guy, another item. Okay, Bolt Seed, yeah. Which move should be forgotten? Uh, which move should be forgotten? Yes, which move should be forgotten? Let's give it a Leer. There we go. One, two, and poof. Uh, Geico forgot how to use Leer. And Geico in Bolt Seed. Nice. Okay, four as an item. Nice. Okay. Super Potion. Nice. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna use a potion actually on Geico. Yeah. Just cause you could use one. Okay, shoot two cherry berries. Cherry berries, uh, restore, uh, or heal, uh, paralysis, which is way nice. This, this two orange berries. Yep, there we go. Yeah. Cool. Oh, in here, I wanna talk to someone so they give me the Wilmer Pale. I think it's maybe you that gives me it. My name is Steven, yes, okay, yeah. Berries grow in deep soil and stuff and whatnot. Okay, no, never mind, okay. Is it you that gives me the Wilmer Pail? I'm trying to be like my big sisters. I'm growing flowers too. Here you go, it's for you. We got Persian Berry, okay, cool. You can plant a berry and grow it to big, or you can make a Pokemon hold it. But now they have a machine that makes up different berries and makes candies for Pokemon. I want some candy too. Cool. Let's go on to this person next. Look at them. Okay, so I haven't. Uh, I skipped through some of her dialogue. Dang it. <laughs> the more attention you give to flowers, the more beautifully they bloom. You like tending flowers, I'm sure, but you can have this. We get the Wilmer Pail, nice, which is, we can water berries. Yeah, okay, um, while berries plants are growing, water them with the, with the, with the Wilmer Pail. Oh, another thing, if you don't have, if you don't pick berries for a while, they drop off it onto the ground, but they, they sprout again. Isn't that awesome? It's like, they have the will to live. Uh-huh, yeah, but, uh, since my internal battery is dry, apparently, uh, the clock based events will no longer occur, so I don't think I can really grow any berries, which kind of stinks, but that's okay. I've gone through several playthroughs of the third generation games with just having no berries, uh, having to not bury any berries after the one I originally picked them. That was a Zigzagoon. There's a potion, nice. Okay. I'm just checking all these suspicious spots for hidden items. 
Yeah, it's a super potion, awesome. Okay, cool, I'm gonna get out of here. That, that wasn't an item. Okay, there's a wimple there. Okay, let's hightail it out of here. Let's see here, do I want to put... Ooh, wait, wait, yes. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. Do, have my, do my five, five six guns have item super potions? Awesome. Nugget, awesome. That's awesome. It's a great item to be picking up. Ultra Ball, nice. Ah, oh, man, that was a great idea to catch five uh, six guns just to so pick up for five things. Yeah, nice. Uh, let's t uh, keep, uh, let's keep Gecko up front. We must have been, f we must have faded t uh, to meet. May I ask you for a battle? Sure, why not? I think this is a Roma lady. I could be wrong though. No, it's just a lady. Lady Cindy. Okay, cool. So this is a good, nice level 7. Let's go for the quick attack on this thing. Just tail up on us to lower, or tail up on Geico to lower his defense stat by one stage. That's not very nice, man. Let's get his growl to lower Geico's attack. I want to try a bullet seed, actually. Here we go. Very nice. That was a good pick. A good decision to teach that bullet seed to Geico. Oh my, <laughs> thanks for 1400 Can Put it way up to the front. Okay, here's a uh, last I believe. Should I, I, or shouldn't I? Okay, sure, I will battle. Cool. That's good for you, man. That's good for you. Let's see how many Pokemon do you have. You have two Pokemon, a little tad. Let's go for the tackle. Let's get his absorb on us. Please don't do a lot. Okay, yeah, this is, uh, this is fun. Oh my gosh, why can't you just growl or something? Because you actually damage of uh, weakening down Larry. I mean, come on. <laughs> You're actually kind of being smart. Okay, there you go, growl. That's what I wanted, actually. That's something other than using Absorb on my Larry. Oh my gosh, Larry messed with Tackle. Of course you did, Larry. Come on. Larry, come on. You got. You could have fainted it last turn, but now since you... Yeah, this is bad. You, oh, I wouldn't be surprised if... You, this tackle may not faint it, and of course it won't faint it if it misses. No, my gosh. Come on, Larry. You can do this. I believe in you. I believe in you, Larry. Thank you. There you go. Larry's in the level 8. Awesome. Shroomish, okay. Um, I'm gonna... I'm gonna keep Larry in, but then once the Shroomish comes out, I'm gonna switch to uh, Geico. Stun spoiler. Good thing that I missed. Nice. Now this thing might have effect spoiler, which kind of stinks because it's gonna probably activate. You know, if I'm not careful. Okay, so now Geico is paralyzed, but uh, Quick Attack still goes first, but it still can't be avoid. Like I can't totally avoid. Geico can't totally avoid being paralyzed. It's just a chance by chance. Sometimes it attacks, sometimes it doesn't. So like you saw there, that time I didn't attack because I was paralyzed. Nice. Okay. I should have, I shouldn't have battled. Sorry, I'm sorry, Lass. I forget your name actually, it's Lass something. Thanks for the 1,100, not 1,000, but 112 Poké Dollars. Yeah, we can't chop down that bush yet. I'm gonna wait, I'm gonna do that double battle, uh, in a second. I'm gonna do that fisherman battle in a second. I just gotta figure, I gotta pick up these berries, go back to the Pokemon Center, go to the Pokemon Center in Rush Bros City, and then come back out here. Leopard berries, I think they restore PP of a move. Let me just double check that. Pretty sure that's what they do. Up oh, bears. Um, yeah, restore 10 PP in battle. Awesome. And I think if you talk to this girl, this uh, old elder, um, yeah, she'll give you a berry. If you see berries growing in loamy soil, feel free to take them, but make sure the plant bet you plant a berry in the same spot. That's common courtesy. Here, I'll share it with you. 
So I trust a bear. Trust a bear is a store where he'll uh, wake up a Pokemon if they're if they're asleep. Yeah, yeah. The way you look, you must be a trainer. No, trainers often make Pokemon hold berries. It's up to you to whether to grow berries or use them. I want to use them, of course. I think if you go over here, there's an X item. Maybe like an X attack or something. If I already guess. X defend. Okay, I know it's an X item. So technically we're in Rushbrook City, and now technically we're not. <laughs> Let's see, is there anything I want? To oh, I do, I do want to sell something because I got a nugget, didn't I? I'll get next to find. Okay, cool. I'll do that real quick. Sell next to find. Okay, ether. I'll put that on my PC actually. I'm about to heal my Pokemon too. Okay, so right here in this house, you can actually get the HM for cut, which is really nice. The, the, the determinant expression, the limbo way you move, and your well-trained Pokemon. You're obviously a skilled trainer. No way, don't say a word. I can just tell by looking at you. I'm sure you want to put this, will be capable of putting this HM to good use. No, not, no need to be modest or shy. Go on, take it. This is a HM for cut, so that's awesome. That's HM is cut. It's cut. Um, and HM is one that can be used by Pokemon out of battle. Any Pokemon that can that learned that's learned cut can chop down these tree, thin trees if the trainer has earned the stone badge. And unlike a TM, an HM doesn't break after one use. Nice. So let's teach up the um, Larry right now. Actually, there we go. Nice. Everyone can learn it basically, but five of the six Pokemon are, is, are six zagoons. Wait, 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 cut, cool. Oh, I think I might want to go shopping for a second too, real quick. Bye. Let's buy like two more Pokeballs. Let's buy three more potions. Buy three super potions. Let's buy one antidote. Two pearl seals. One escape rope. Ooh, repels, nice. Buy, like three of them, I guess, for now. There we go, nice. Okay, that's good. Oh good, yeah. We should be good. For now. Here is a way, and here is a fisherman I'm so about to say. I meant to say, here's the way I put away up front basically. Why well, keep a secret? I'm the water Pokemon expert, huh? You don't know me? No, I do not. I don't, I've never seen you in my life. I'm sorry. Let's go for the... Got for cut. Yeah, it's a magic up level six. Cool. That's only a splash. That's always great. I think he just says he might have two magic cups and a tentacle. I can't even remember. But hopefully we can defeat the stupid magic cup <laughs> soon, you know? Because they are very. T they're just annoying to fight, really. In my opinion, at least. Oh, you have three magic cups, of course you do. Just cut again. Yeah, magic cups love them for fun, don't they? Let's just tackle. I mean, ah, uh, dang it. I pressed the left on the arrow key, but apparently that's not too 
hard or something. I didn't do hard enough or something. I thought it wasn't too bad, if I may say so, but I guess not. But but <laughs> so thanks for the 204 poke dollars. Now here's a double battle. You don't have to battle these girls if if you don't talk to them or if you don't only or if you just have one Pokemon with you in your party. So yeah, okay, let's battle with our Pokemon. Says Gina. Cool. They're twins, by the way. Twins, Gina and Mia. Okay, cool. Well, Ted and C dot. Nice. I kind of want to go after this low tad because it seems more of a threat than the C dot. Let's cut the low tad <laughs> and use quick attack on the low tad. Okay, yeah, it was growl on both we got Cone Wavy. Of course she did. Let's just take out the old tad. Alright, good level nine, awesome. Well, I was trying to learn head, but nice. Yeah, let's uh, let's get rid of growl. Just bind, okay, fine. We'll uh, use a uh, tail whip and well, we gotta use one move here. Uh, let's get rid of let's use absorb because I'm trying not to, you know, try. I'm trying not to cause too much damage to it, of course. That still doesn't move around. Dang it, okay, fine. We got this though. Okay, there we go. Headbutt and quick attack. Okay, yeah, this is bad. Larry, I'm sorry. Okay, Larry's going down. Okay, fine. We'll send out three, I guess. I'm sorry whether that happened. I thought like it was gonna lose energy and then we'd attack it rather than what happened was where we just attacked it, made it store more energy from the impact of our moves that did damage and then use release and <laughs> unleash the energy. Dang it. That's my poor judgment right there. Anyway, three is not level five, awesome, and three the one tail nice. Cool. Losing upsets me, sorry. Thanks for one hundred and ninety two poker dollars though. Okay, I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Center and heal up real quick, so I'll be right back. Okay. Let's, uh, we could take on the gym now if we wanted, but I'm gonna wait for that. I'm just gonna wait on it for a little bit. Here's about 115. Uh, do you have battle in a, exploring a cave isn't like walking on a road. You never know what, when what Pokemon will appear. It's, it's full of suspense. That's actually true. I about 15 Rush Pro City is just south then of this place, of course. Obviously. I think here's a potion. Or super potion, I think. Yeah, super potion. Awesome. Nice. Okay, there's that. Okay, so let's see here. Um, I'll keep where it front, I guess. Here's a youngster. My Pokemon will check them out. Okay, fine. Maybe I will. Headbutt. <laughs> okay, nice. Flinched. Awesome. Let's tackle on us. Okay. Let's go for the cut. Nope, of course Larry, we missed. You will miss with your stupid cut. Ah, oh, come on Larry. Come on. Let's just cut again. Thank you for hitting that time. My chop, okay. Please don't have low kick or anything. I bet you have low kick though. But I'm still gonna try to defeat you. Flinched, okay cool. It didn't do that much of damage. Just we on us, okay. 
I'm just so afraid it's gonna use a low kick or something, yet I'm still keeping Hoi Hoi out. Oh my gosh, wait. Yeah, that was bad. Okay, fine. I'm sorry, Larry. I could... That's like twice in this part that I've misju had misjudgment with uh, keeping Larry out or, you know, t uh, switching over to a different Pokemon like Geico. I mean, like, come on, how can I be... I've, I, don't, I don't even know. I feel bad in, enough as it is, you know? But yeah, this, this much up has to go down. There we go, nice. Yeah, Gekko's not level 14. Awesome, nice. Okay, I'm going back to the Pokemon Center, so I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back right here. So, let's see. Did anyone pick up an item? Oh, three did. Nice. Four store. Awesome. Oh my gosh, I have to do a lot of rearrange in here. There we go, nice. Okay, that's good enough. Oh, come on. Okay, Larry fainted as Zigzagoon, so that's good, I guess. Here's a butt catcher. A book Pokemon I tough, let's battle. Okay. Let's go for the headbutt on this Wimple. Did about one third, awesome, nice. Okay, yeah, nice. Poison Sting. Oh no! No! There we go, cool. Cut hits, awesome. Oh, wait, was number 10? Level 10, awesome. Mankata, okay, we'll stay in. Go for the headbutt. Ooh, it flinched, awesome. Let's go for another headbutt then. <laughs> flinched again, awesome. So Kuhn, okay. Let's harden on. Okay, let's get his harden. Fine, that's fine with me. This silly Silcoon. And then one more head, but should faint it, but you never know what hap what'll happen. There we go, nice. I lost. I thought I had you. Sorry, man. Thanks for 128 pocket dollars, though. Here's an item. It is a repel. Awesome. Might want to use a repel, actually. <laughs> but first, let's battle this person. Let me teach you how strong my po my adorable Pokemon is. Okay, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see how adorable and strong it looks. Here's the last Janice. Okay, she's a male. Okay, it's level 10. Go for the head, but. Now, Meryl has a lot of defense, so like, it's not gonna be easy to take it down with physical attacks. But, we can still, you know, try. Ooh, flinched, nice. Okay, yeah, flinched again, awesome. Let's go for it. Let's, I'm gonna trust attack, we'll hit. There we go, nice. Awesome. Where's the level 11, awesome. Okay, I'm gonna use a Pell here. Actually, run then. Okay, um. I wanna give this. Switch to, um. Geico, because I know this hiker has, like, Grack type Pokemon and stuff. So let's take this item from 4 if we'll heal. Awesome. Yeah, if the tunnel doesn't go through, then I'll just go over the top. I guess you could do that in some cases, but not, like, all cases, to be honest. But. Yeah, that's okay. Hiker Clark. Okay, he has a Jeter. Nice. I think I want to use bolt seed on this thing. Oh, nice. That was easy. <laughs> Get another G, dude. Cool. Let's use another bolt seed then. Bolt seed, bolt seed. Oh, 
and he has one more Geo Dude. I think his thing is that he has a Geo level six, a Geo level eight, and a Geo level ten or something like that. I don't, maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. There we go. Nice. Good level fifteen. Awesome. Gasp, gasp, losing made me tired. Sorry, man. Okay, yeah, let's talk to this person. Neror, I, I want to dig that tunnel. This is the tunnels, tunnel, tunnelers, tunnelers rest house. Cool. So over here, he has an item. Let's grab it. Next special, okay, cool. Nice. Okay, this wants in the wall. Yeah, we'll get to that later. I think it's like you need secret power, which is a TM we'll get later to like build your own secret bases and stuff, and you can build your secret base in one of those instances of the wall. It's kind of fun actually. So yeah, let's put um way up to the front, and way actually has an item for us. Nice. It's a super potion, awesome. How many super potions do I have now? Just out of curiosity. I have I have nine. Wow, that's crazy. <laughs> Here is the Rush Turf Tunnel linking Rushboro to Verdant Turf. Uh, the tunnel project has been cancelled. Aw oh, man. Let's go inside anyway. I think up here is a Pokeball. I shouldn't really run because then I'd have a higher chance of winning the wild Pokemon. I think the only Pokemon you can find in this Rust Rustarf tunnel is Wismer, which is a normal type Pokemon. I kind of recommend it. It's a good Pokemon. I've used it before in one of my playthroughs. I think I used it in my Pokemon Emerald uh, Walkthrough Guide project. So yeah. Oh yeah. Repels the Wildfrog. Let's put, let's put another one. Just so we're not running into any of them. That'd be nice. Okay, so it's repels. There we go. Nice. Okay, nice. Okay, there's nothing here actually. Oh wait, that's not the way to have to get the gym badge. Okay, so we can actually head off back to Rushboro City then. Actually, that was a good reminder, I guess, right there. Uh, we can't battle these trainers up here because we need cut. We don't. We have the gym for cut, but we don't have the badge yet. So yeah, with the, let's take on the gym next. But we'll probably do that next part. So yeah. I was affected with Warf just in time, awesome. Yeah, so this has been my Pokemon Ruby Redo Walk the Guide part. Next part, we'll take on the Rush uh, Rustboro City Pokemon Gym right here. Rustboro City Pokemon Gym, Lady Roxanne, the rock loving uh, honor student. Cool. So, yes, yeah, so this is go again. I would like to mention goodbye, and I'll see you guys next part of my Pokemon Ruby Redo Walk the Guide.